Coming to you live from JDM Hawaii lot number two. So this is the graveyard, which is so sad to see because I'm someone who doesn't get really attached to cars, but the things I'm seeing right now are breaking my heart. So this guy, this is the famous Barbie K truck. First time I came to Hawaii, I saw this. This is one of the coolest Suzuki's I've ever seen. This one is getting its heart removed. Look at this. I was just talking to Slater and I was telling him like, no, 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 before we go any further, how can we figure out to get this to New York? We got to figure this out. Look at this truck. Interior super cool. Got the shaggy roof. Look at the speakers here. Huge sub here. Interior is nice and clean. This one only has 23 on the dot. 1,000 kilometers. It is a five-speed and four-wheel drive. Come on. This has to get saved. I don't know how. He said he might take the guts out of this Suzuki and put it in here because he was going to do the opposite take everything out of here and put it in here which is just like come on look at this truck <laughs> look at this suzuki i need this so maybe manifesting a little too early but if this gets into running condition i told him that i would buy this i would buy this we'll figure it out we'll get it to new york i'll put way for the fame there i have the coolest pink little truck ever then next to this we have a suzuki two sandbar vans that are getting some maintenance and then we have a honda that has its eyes ripped out of it this guy is also a parts car. And then this Starlet is really cool because this used to be a rally car. I'll see if I can show you guys. He said he's gonna bring this back to life. So it isn't just a graveyard. It's also, I guess, a hospital, you can say. So this guy used to be a rally champion. I can't wait to see this. It has an aluminum plate that's a um, eighth of an inch aluminum plate on, under the whole bottom. Yeah, this is, I hope by the time I come back, this is ready. Cause this thing is cool. It has a full cage. That's where the map used to go. AFRs, five speed, boost gauge up there. Has a sunroof surprisingly, no back seat, everything's stretched out. This thing is cool. It can't be technically a graveyard. Let's see what's under here. He's got some power on her. Yeah, this is cool. So cylinder four is dead. Uh, we just basically need that top half. Yeah. Um, just gotta get that. Yeah, no, this is cool. This is parts. This is not parts. I already told him that. One, oh, this one. one. Yeah, this one has its eyes ripped out of. I know. Yeah, we saw. Well, we got the, the headlights taken out, the California mirrors are gone. The seat we put in the Sunny that we had. The Hatsu Sunny? The, yep. The, the, oh, um, nice. The Datsun Sunny. Oh, Datsun Sunny, yeah. yeah. We put that in there. Um, the body is just no good. Barbie is coming to new york it's gonna be saved barbie is gonna be saved it's, it's gonna, gonna be, be saved we're gonna take parts from yes this take this and bring this barbie, back to life bring barbie back and yeah we need that yeah. and then the jimny you guys know how much i love jimnies oh my god that was it's, it's a super cool yellow jimny yellow and white look at this car we, we gotta, we nice gotta, rims We'll get a motor and put it in. Interior is clean. Let's pop the hood though and I'll show you guys. Top is nice and clean. Got a fifth rim. Muffler back here too. Look at this. I'm loving this Jimny. And then he tells me this. Wham! Like, come on. <laughs> the nice ones are getting killed. Uh, this is a very, very nice Jimny. It's perfect for Hawaii. It's yellow, white. Yeah clean nice rims not done yet not done yet this one's gonna get reincarnated too hopefully yeah. and then this which is never gonna die this is, this is, not this is like king kong and really never gonna die yeah. this is kong right here. and then the vivio how could i forget this sti everything let's check this out you guys know i like the vivio so i mean look we got oh wow that's nice that's definitely like custom fitted voltage gauge like is that stock or is no, that no it can't be stock i've seen a couple of videos that radio is nice too yeah so. bunch of gauges oil temp there but yeah this clock yeah this cup holders this was repossessed so this one is soon going to be for sale and reincarnated also yep pioneer speakers there up. oh yeah this one got some goodies to it Repossessed. Oh, look at this, the boost gauge. I was wondering where the boost gauge was. I was like, you got all these gauges and look at that. On the door. I've never yeah, seen that before. Oil pressure over here. Oil pressure, oil temp, boost, voltage, clock, STI clusters. If this thing was five speed, it might be coming to New York too. This is nice. Now we're back at JDM Hawaii. Hey, what's up? So over here we have 
This can't be the graveyard. What is this? No, this is the service center. This, this is the service is, center. Um, we're doing a bit of everything right now. I know we kind of touched on tires a little bit the other day, but if you, I don't know if you can get down here, you see, look how much meat this thing has. Yeah. It looks like it's good, right? But to, the, to average Joe, they would still be using these. I mean, look look how much meat is on these tires. Look at this, this. Yeah. But look, look. There's yeah. oh, that one. It's separating. It's dry rot. So, yeah, these are dead tires. So that's why we mark them like this. Every vehicle gets checked, especially the tire. And if they're bad, we get rid of them. Tires, tires, tires. So obviously some of these are not JDM tires, but those ones over there, as you can yeah. see. So I mean, just for example. So these are all garbage? These are all garbage. Because this one has a lot of life too, if you just look at yeah, it, the but, naked I eye. Mean, it Even it these little like grabbers. Life, if they got, if they're dry rot, we take them off. Yeah, and most of the K-Truck tires, most of the K-Tires in general are dry rot. Yeah. Like as someone who's owned like, 10k cars 99 percent of the time if you guys watch my videos yep. the first thing i'm doing is buying tires yep so we don't yeah we just get rid of them here we're doing this the customer vehicle was, was not sold by us they brought it in and said it was stalling out and there seems to be something going on something funky with the gas so where is the floater here it is mm. fuel sending unit that came out of that tank. So, completely rusted out, not functioning obviously. The tank has rust in there. So we basically dropped the tank. You can hear that. Yeah. You can hear. You can hear the. Yeah, it's just bare rust um, down inside there. So we're swapping out the tank for him. And yeah, that's, that's what we're doing here. And that's coming out of that parts car. Um, yep, that's coming out of that parts car that we bought just for stuff like this. Over here we have a Honda Acti that we're doing an engine swap. This is the engine right here. We're gonna be putting in this bad boy. Here, another customer car. And yeah, that's what we're doing over there. Gonna we'll talk about this guy here. I guess. <laughs> <laughs> so we were trying to get this for the for the show, we didn't get it in time because we felt a little shimmy. Yeah. Um, turns out that it has a bad U joint. So the the U joint for this um, was bent. It's just so we're working on getting this replaced. We will have this up and running and up and ready before you leave. I give them so a, you can drive it. We yeah, put I give a lot them. of work into trying to get this together, and oh my God, it's. I yeah. still haven't showed them the whole truck, but this is the <laughs> the biggest sneak peek you guys have got so far. Yeah. I'll show you guys a little bit of the interior. Look at this. So we, we do we do what we do, you know, we just do customer work and just stuff that needs to be done. We do all out servicing here, pretty much. Yeah. Not afraid to Even get if my it's not dirty. a customer's car. Even yeah. We take take on mm -hmm. outside customer's car too. We have another van over here. It's the highest. It's not ours, but stalling out. Customer towed it in, so taking care of that too. So yep, we are we can handle any mechanical, even Barbie, even Barbie, even Barbie, Barbie. Barbie, Barbie soon gonna be here. Barbie like will be <coughs> reincarnated. Yeah, how's that? It should be. Promise, I promise. Right. Barbie Pink, is coming pinky back. Promise. Pinky, pinky promise. On Barbie's camera coming too. on camera. On camera, so it's real. Barbie's coming back. All right, so I'm here with Slater, and I was just telling him that that Jimny, like to put another 660 K68 doesn't make sense. Like a lot of people rotary swap Jimnys. So if anyone's <laughs> in the Hawaii area and you have some recommendations to Please. put under the Jimny, let him know. Tell me, tell me what to do with it. Because um, I mean, you could case swap it, but that's probably a lot of work. Yeah. Because people case swap everything. So, yeah. yeah. Um, what what to do? What to do? I mean, you could case swap it. Case swap it. Rotary swap is very. You know, J11, J12, yeah. whatever. But it's it's yeah. It should get or even a samurai motor, because those are probably way cheaper. You can get a 1.1 .1 or 1.3 samurai motor in there for True. change. And I'm pretty sure there's some samurais. In yeah, the you could definitely do that. That would be good. Yeah. No. Well, there's another, there's another, is it a Geo Metro? There's another one that a lot of people put in that car too. I oh, forgot. Is it a tracker? 
yeah the tracker too you can put that motor but there's another one there's another one i'm gonna look it up too but if anyone has any recommendations hit up jdm hawaii and let them know so we can put something cool in that jimny we gotta let that yellow jimny come back in life absolutely what about the starlet the starlet motor yeah or what to do with it what to do with it because it, it needs a, um or if like i would love for somebody to take it team up with me yeah take the starlet bring it back to life bring it back to bring it back to its rally days Just bring it back to its rally days so yeah. what's wrong with it it has a dead cylinder it has what? a we call it a dead hole yeah. cylinder four is dead there's no compression that's the only thing yeah. that's wrong with it um I'm looking for ideas. If yeah. you have an idea of yeah, what you could has possibly to, do. Yeah. That car needs to come back to life too. Yeah. Because that has good heritage and like that was once probably the coolest car. Yeah, and they're having because now they're there, I think they might be opening the track in Maui. Oh really? The race track. To do rally? To the rally Ooh. stuff. To the racing and stuff. So if that is possible, yeah. I would love to have a JDM represented rally yeah. car. Like livery, JDM Hawaii on it. Everything. Yeah. Everything. I mean yeah. It would only make sense. Yeah. So hopefully someone watching this <laughs> that's in Hawaii can team up and make it make sense with the Jimny and the Starlet. Yeah. Like Barbie. both of those together we need back in its glory days. Yes. And the Barbie, but you and got the Barbie. You got the Barbie. I got downhill. the Barbie. I, the Barbie's I gotta, easy. I want a personal touch the Barbie. Yeah, the Barbie's I gotta, easy. I gotta, yeah. yeah, I gotta keep the Barbie. But the other ones we need back. Yeah, I, I need I need help on that one. Yeah. So remember the name. This is way before the fame.